Okay guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make um, these very small mini cookie cutters that you can use on your projects or in your displays or whatever. And I'm going to show you how to use it out of these things that you get off the pencil. And so basically I'm going to show you how to use them first. First you're going to run your cookie cutter that you made over the water and just press it in and make sure to remove it just going to do that and uh, um, I think sometimes when you run it over water it doesn't stick to the um, clay so that's why I do that but sometimes um, it does stick as you see here so don't worry all you do is press this with um, like a pencil or whatever you want and there you have a heart um, on the other side there will be um, this dot but if you just use enough water then um, you can make sure, um, then you can um, ensure that it won't stick to the actual cookie cutter itself. But I think this is a very reliable and cute way to make um, some small hearts out of cookie cutters, um, out of like some metal that you can get from a pencil. And make sure to put some water on your clay as well when doing this. But if you're using Fimo, make sure not to use water because Fimo gets creamy when um, you use water. So. Um, there are just some hearts I cut out, and yeah. So we're going to make um, a heart like this. I don't know if you can see that. So basically for this, all you need are some round nose pliers and um, your fingers. So pretty much what you're going to do is have your um, take your round nose pliers and just, you know, like press it down. And the thing that's going to make the um, little heart shape is because this has um, a round feature. So you're pretty much going to play around with this, like I'm pressing this down currently, and you, you can see pretty much the heart forming. And um, you know, use your hands, you know, you can bend this with your hands as well, it's not going to, um, it does change with, uh, when you put a little force on it, the shape does change. So all you're going to do is pretty much play around with it and make sure you have um, the heart shape you desire. It takes quite a while to play around with it though. So you can see the heart shape forming. Push it down. Um, it's definitely not as um, perfect as the heart I just showed you. Um, my actual cookie cutter. This is just for uh, tutorial demonstration. So yeah, just kind of press it down. As you can see, um, the shape is slowly forming. I just need to make this one a little bigger. And this one a little smaller. And then, yeah. So basically, um, just for tutorial, I'm going to stop here. But as you can see, I've pretty much formed a heart. And this one is a very clean and crisp one. And I love to use this um, on my clay um, when I make small heart cookies or whatever. And I think they're very cute and uh, simple and nice to use. So, yeah. I hope you guys um, actually benefited from this tutorial or even tried this. If you guys have any more tips on how to make um, miniature cookie cutters, um, please tell me. I'm also going to make another video, probably in a response to this one, like um, this one I made right now, of how to make um, miniature cookie cutters but bigger in size so that instead of being like this small, um, it's going to be like around that small. By the way, if any of you guys are wondering how I got this off a pencil, um, the metal is, yeah, so it's from a pencil, and basically I just held this down with force and wiggled my pencil, and then I got it free. I don't know if I said this already because I did um, a couple of tries on this tutorial and my camera died. And um, to get the um, eraser out of it, I just took that same pencil I removed and pushed out the eraser itself from the metal it's metal so that's how I got it out and I was able to uh, design it with some pliers so I hope this actually helped I feel like I was blabbing most of the time and you might not get it so if you guys have any questions please tell me and yeah so I'm gonna upload two videos today so watch out for that thank you bye